Hi, my name is Gabrielle Gerbert. I'm going to teach you how to make um, a boutonniere. Um, so some of the supplies you might need are a pair of pliers, a pair of scissors, some floral wire, some floral tape, some leaves from a bouquet of flowers, a flower or two, and boot mirror pins. So first, we're going to take our flower and cut it about right here. The first step is going to be prepping all of your supplies. So you're going to take your flower and a piece of wire, and it's about four inches long and you're going to put it first put it through the base of the flower and wrap it down and then you're going to take another piece of wire and you're going to put it at the base of the stem And wrap it down and then you're gonna take your floral tape and you're gonna wrap the wire in the flower stem and you have to wrap it tight the tape sticks to itself it doesn't stick to the flower so if it's not tight enough it won't stay so I got it wrapped around the base of the flower and then you just wrap it down around the wire and the stem, make sure it's tight, okay, so that's prepping our flower, the second thing we need to prep is our leaves, so the way you prep a leaf is you're going to take the wire and poke it through the back to go through the front, and there should be a loop on the front, just like that. And then you wrap the wire back this way and twist it. So then you have this long stem of wire for your boutonniere. And we're going to do that with this second leaf. So we're going to cut another piece of wire. do the same thing from the back, stick it through, make a loop in the back, twist it. So now we've prepped everything, so now we can start wrapping it all together. So first you're going to take your flower you're going to cut off the excess wire. And then you're going to take your flower and your first leaf and you're going to put it behind the flower just like that. And then your second leaf, you're going to put it on the other side just like this. And then take the floral tape and wrap it from the stems the way to the bottom just like we did with the flower itself and the reason why we put wire through the, the leaves in the flower is so that when the floral tape is coating the boutonniere you can move stuff around the way you want it so it's not stuck the way that you tape it on here. And I'll show you what I mean in a second. So we've had this all wrapped up nice and tight. And if you want to move a leaf, you just have to move it like that. And now it's opened up more. And that's why there's a wire. You can also add fillings 
this is just a pearl, um, a little uh, wire with pearls on it, and you can tape this in here too, but I'm going to leave that out. So this is basically the uh, simple version of a boutonniere, and then you need <coughs> your boutonniere pin, and you just stick it through the back, going upward, and make sure that it's going into the boutonniere so it doesn't poke when you put it on somewhere. So this is the finished product. You can make it bigger, you can make it more intricate, but this is just a simple version. And that is how you make a boutonniere.